Hey everyone, and welcome back to episode 962 of Fallout 4. The last episode, things we have to do some, some things a little bit different. We have to uh, do the whole Institute quest line because the Minutemen be borked. And the hope here is... Actually, it, it's, it's this very quest. You see where it says, speak to the Minuteman contact? Apparently, like, there's an option to side with them, and maybe that'll fix the brokenness that's going on with Preston, but uh, I decided I'll do the Institute ending first, I will do the, like, Brotherhood of Steel then, and then I'll do, like, the Railroad, and then we'll try to settle on the Minuteman ending. We'll see how that goes. But there was a bug with Preston, prevented me, essentially, from just outright doing the Minuteman ending first. And here we are doing doing it in a little convoluted manner in an effort to fix the brokenness that is Preston because of the Nuka World DLC. But uh, here we are. I gotta, we gotta go convince some guy to leave with us and uh, not go outside and make a scene. So we don't freak the Minutemen out. That's the hope, but uh, yeah, hopefully you guys, of you course, are enjoying the, uh, the, the Fallout videos. I do certainly appreciate those of you who take the time to like the videos, and I thank you dudes for that support. Without further ado, I present to you kittens, and more kittens, and uh, yeah, let's go talk to this dude. Mr. Wallace, I'm here to talk to you. You're another one of, uh, of them, aren't you? Are you a robot? Mm, no, 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 I'm not a robot. Sir, are you okay? Have you been injured in any way? I'm locked in a bathroom to avoid killer robots. Of course I'm not okay! <laughs> I've heard all the stories. I know exactly what happens to people when the Institute shows up. Well, it's not happening to me. Mm -hmm. Hey, just calm down, okay? I just want to talk to you. <sighs> fine, fine. What do you want from me? Everything. Mr. Wallace... Would you be willing to help the Institute? Help? The Institute? But aren't, aren't they... you... I'm, I'm... the bad guys? The Institute has an engineering problem that your scientific expertise could help solve. In exchange for helping us out, you'd be granted access to the most advanced research facility imaginable. Whatever research you wanted to perform, anything, it's possible there. I promise. You'd be safe and secure, in a way that's completely impossible anywhere else. Hmm. Hmm. Think about your future, Wallace. This is a way to secure it. I suppose that's one way to look at it. Okay, fine. I'll go. I'm looking forward to working for you, future director. Ah, <sighs> okay. I think we've got this under control now. Thanks. I mean, thanks for the assist. No, oh, screw you. There are plenty of things I'd rather have done than come fix you. <laughs> hey, I'm here to help. You're welcome. I really mean it. I owe you one. I'll see you back in the Institute. Well, wow. okay, that's good. Yeah, but like as I understand it, you can just talk to the Minutemen and be like, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, I agree with you guys, the Institute's crazy, and then I, I guess at that point, I don't know, maybe, maybe that has something to do with the turning point in the quest line, it'll help me out. Well, we'll see, because I mean, either way, like, you get the banish from the Institute, like, marker, we can get whatever here, it's called, I don't, I don't know, we'll see. So we got a new quest, powering up, we gotta go speak to daddy, gotta go speak to father, which is my kid, but we're calling him dad. <sighs> Just a little bit awkward. Just, just a little bit. Just, 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 just a little bit weird. I'm kind of curious to see if the Institute people work. I keep saying Institute people, but the Minutemen will be out here. Because if they are, I don't even want to talk to them. Yeah, um, um, are you guys going to go on your... I'm not here. Well, they're just, uh... <laughs> they're just chilling. Don't mind me. I got to go back and talk to Daddy. <laughs> yeah, I'm out of there. Screw that. Not my problem no more. I probably should have seen, seen what happened if I talked to him, to be honest. <laughs> I just totally I ditched him. Oh, blah, blah, blah. You guys are always talking about those raiders at Libertalia. All right, so I guess Father is just uh, right above me here, right? He should just be in here in his little chair. you in your chair. Nope. Hey, bud. Ah, there you are. There I am. I cannot express how pleased I am. Our new guest is familiarizing himself with his surroundings. Yet he's already pointed out several inefficiencies in our methods. With his help, Phase 3 will be ready in no time. And it's all thanks to you. A lot of work went into this before I even arrived. Just how close are we? It shouldn't take long at all. 
The facilities division has it well in hand. There is one more part for you to play, and I think you might enjoy it. It is time to announce our presence to the Commonwealth, to request that they do not interfere with our plans. You should be the one to do it. I feel like this is going to alienate, like, everybody. For me. Huh. What kind of announcement are we talking about? A broadcast. An announcement to the Commonwealth that the Institute is not to be trifled with. As the incoming director, that responsibility naturally falls to you. We've prepared some remarks for you to record. Once you're finished, we'll broadcast them to the entire Commonwealth. Use the microphone here and follow the script. It's quite simple. I'm sure you'll do fine, Father. Announcement script added. Record the speech. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. For years now, you have suspected that the Institute still exists. That we are among you. It is true. But it is not the whole truth. We're here. And we are. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> here to help. Our superior technology represents the, the future of the Commonwealth. Today, we activate our nuclear reactor, ensuring that we will persevere long after the world above ground ceases to exist. Ensuring that mankind has a future. We have no desire to interfere in the unimportant details of your... Pointless struggles. <laughs> oh my god. ...daily lives. We simply insist that you do not interfere with Institute operations. To do so would result in... Unnecessary difficulties, tragedy, you're completed in the... <laughs> wow. Unnecessary difficulties for all parties. Rest easy. Know that the future is... I'm winging this. I'm winging this. Looking bright. And that mankind will thrive under our guidance. I, I was... I, I won the whole thing. Well, that Winged. was... Interesting. Perhaps not what we originally intended. But it will certainly get your point across. Okay. Now it's time to make sure that everyone hears it. How would you feel about making a little trip to Diamond City? Somehow I imagine they won't like me. What do you want with Diamond City? Nothing with the city itself. This is a bit of a shortcut, actually. The radio station in Diamond City is listened to by many in the Commonwealth. If we'd like the people to hear what we have to say, it's the best way to reach them. Before we preempt their broadcasts, we need to ensure it reaches the maximum range possible. I've been assured that the necessary parts are on site. You'll just need to install them to boost the broadcasting power. Report back when you're done. We should be ready by then. Mm hmm. Reconfigure the transmitter. Man, I just, I gotta say, I just, I, I just don't get the Institute. Like, you know, you, you guys know that I'm not a huge fan of the Institute and everything they do and yada 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 their methods and blah 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 I don't know it's just like why replace people like what the hell if you have this technology make the robots make keep them robots make them do exactly as you say and how you say it use them as physical labor and then proceed to like fix everything up oh my oh so difficult oh oh the boogeyman we got to make people that are look look exactly like people it's just, it's weird. It's like, why? Why, guys? Like, you have the, we literally have the technology. We can literally rebuild him. Like, like we, we, we actually can do the thing. So, I don't get why we don't just make things better. I, I, the Institute's fucking weird, man. Imagine if you had just like a armada of these robots to do anything and everything you wanted them to do. Like, you could make everything so great. Yeah. And don't give them intelligence because we don't need another eye robot. We don't need like the the, the the three laws or whatever it was. I don't remember. It's been a long time since I've read the book slash seen the movie. Like I like years, but you get the point. Like I, I'm I feel like there's a better way to go about it than the way the institute. Oh no, I'm not I'm not here super mutant. And the institute wants to take it, but hey, what you got a stare in? I mean, you do. So Crocker killed Earl. Stone. Oh yeah. And you figured that out? What? You trying to make us look bad? I don't really have to try that hard to make you look bad. I mean, come on, let, let, let's face it. You're, you're not exactly... <coughs> you're not exactly great at your gerb. <laughs> hey, you that traitor? Oh, yeah, that, that, Quincy? that Quincy guy. You sell any... I remember that guy. Hey, you. Uh, <coughs> huh? 
No? Nah. Yes. Clueless. Yeah. Huh? Literally clueless. At least the other people had something to say. That guy's just. Yes. Hello. Yes. All right. Well, uh, let's go mess with a radio. Oh, that dude's hauling ass. What's whoa, 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 buddy, buddy, whoa, buddy. Hey. Oh, hey. You're getting pretty chummy with that. Hey, hey, whoa. What's? Oh, that's the guy that sells the water, right? Hi there. You shoot people, sir? My dad says outside to shoot people. I shoot people who shoot at me. Do all you outsiders wear such funny clothes? Yes, we all look like giant robots. Hey there, mister. Oh, hey there, little boy. That's, that's a little weird. All right, uh, where does it want me to go? It wants me to go to that, that marker over here. You got multiple Don't markers. God, every time I hear the voice, I just, I just, I just remember Codsworth. Like, I miss him. I haven't taken him out for a, for a spin in a while. I've been using that doggo meat for, for quite a quite a while. I like my Lone Wonder buff. It's nice. It's not really necessary, but, you know, I just like it. Oh, yeah, this was the radio station with that one kid that we, you know, like, had to surgically give balls to because he was, like, really weird. I and forgot what you had done for me. Him, Travis. Hey. Hey, bud. Yeah, th th this kid right here. I'm here to hijack your stuff. Radio thing with buttons. Radio thing with dials. Radio thing with tubes. What? Dude, you're kidding me. Radio equipment slot activate. A piece of equipment can be mounted in the slot. <laughs> Install the thing with the dials, the tubes, the buttons. Alright, let's let's give this thing tubes. Okay, let's try this. Hey look, it worked. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, I think the radio sounds You wanna have a thing with dials? Maybe this goes here. I'm not getting near. And I guess you can have the thing really with buttons. Complaints. You go. Oh. Man, I'm like I'm I'm just I'm a natural. I am a natural. I should take up a career in this shit. I should be an electrician. Screw this whole YouTube thing making a dollar per Fallout video because, well, nobody watches me. Also, YouTube algorithm is terrible. <laughs> like, fuck it, man. I'll go, I'll go be an electrician. I'll go, I'll go do something with my life. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Now, thank God we can just TP to the Institute from the uh, Diamond City because it's, you know, it's open or whatever. Good to see you. So I have to go in here. I can't Fathers in advanced systems. Humbling. Yeah, yeah, you'd be humbled by my presence. I don't know why you'd be humbled by my presence, but yeah, you'd be humbled by that presence. <laughs> I'm literally nothing special, I'm just a dude in power armor. Hey, look, this is open. Ooh. Ooh. This was locked up before. This is the Institute Reactor. Oh. This was, like, locked up by laser grids or whatever. Ooh. Remember, we're not really going to bother stealing things because, again, this save will... Inevitably be loaded. This is me experiencing the ending for the Institute, and we'll go do the other factions and whatnot. Hey, um, don't shoot me. I'm, I'm, I'm friendly. I think. I'm friendly in this save file. What do you got up here? Just a whole bunch of garbo? Can't press any of the doodads? That's sad days. Alright, I'm gonna pull out a gun here and, you know, just, just have it, because whatever. I don't really know what's back here. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. Let's be prepared. Am I gonna get all decontaminated and whatnot? Hooded clean room suit. Ah, that's the thing that Allie and that guy earlier was wearing. That weird, like, hazmat suit. You know what? I kind of want to pick it up and, like, read the stats on it, because is it is it equal to, like, a hazmat suit, for example? Hooded clean room suit. No? Doesn't the hazmat suit have, like, a thousand uh, rad resists? I feel like it does. Decontaminate me, daddy. Oh, oh, yeah. oh spritz me good. Oh, hmm. Hmm. All right, that's not spritz it. Okay, we did it. We're good. I says I have to go speak with them. But I guess I get to go up here and be above these peons. Plebs. Plebs. A lot of them. Enjoy your trip to the big city. Sure. It's done then. The transmitter has been modified. Yeah, I, I, I put the things with the things. Um, um, I really don't know if I did it right. I'm all set. But what about the reactor? The initial round of tests is finished. All readings are nominal. So yes, I think we're ready. I'll let you do the honors. This, my friends is the moment we've all worked towards. After all your effort, the time has finally come to start our reactor. No longer will we be forced to compromise to survive. No more will we need worry about outpacing our resources. My father and I couldn't be more proud of what you have helped us accomplish. And we look forward to achieving even greater things in the future. The Institute is now truly mankind's best hope. Thank you. All of you. I get to go press the button? 
There's a, there's a terminal here. Do I have to go in there? This seems safe. This seems really safe. Can I get out of here now? This doesn't seem like a good idea. I don't want to be in there. It's all fancy, though. Look at that shit. Ooh. Ooh. I feel like we should close the door. I, 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 don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't like this. I might have to say, I might have to use the terminal. Terminal use. Uh, high levels of radiation are likely present in the reactor chamber. Check current status of radiation levels before entering. Use proper radiation protection regardless of radiation levels is highly encouraged. Reactor status. Connection to reactor status is okay. On, or offline, radiation levels inside a reactor. Let's check. Uh, they are low. Exercise caution when entering a rea uh, reactor regardless of radiation levels. Okay. Uh, let's initiate reactor startup sequence. Powering up, radiation levels increasing. Reaction startup successful. Extreme caution when entering the reactor chamber. Ooh, buddy. Hey, buddy, we did it's the thing. almost hard to believe. After all those years of hard work, here we are. We've arrived. Look what you've made possible. Now that the reactor works, what's next for the Institute? We'll get to that. There's more work to be done before the Institute's future is guaranteed. The Directorate has convened a meeting about how to proceed. I'm not going to attend. You should be there as director. I am a director. Folksy doodles. Come at me, bro. Sean. I often wonder what the Institute's founders would think of our accomplishments. They'd be like, why are you creating real people instead of robots? Someday, Father. This will all be yours. That's my line, kid? Our advances will, in time, change the world. Son. This truly is a wonderful So, like, place. ass backwards. It's still just really weird, the whole, like, father-son dynamic going on here. Is there anything, you know, like, else up here? Or no? Just take a look, see Loodle. We got some loot. We got a dish rag. It's just casually a hunting rifle shoved in a briefcase there that totally wouldn't fit in the first place. But, hey, man. We're playing Fallout. You take your logic and you get the hell out of here. Okay, we're on the ground floor. What's going on down here? This is where the plebs were all convening and whatnot. Oh, you get radiation when you get close to it. Okay, I mean, that makes sense, but... Neat. Neat. Recorder. My recorder now. Don't you be recording me. I mean, I guess I did already record myself, so I guess I gave consent. Uh, I do not consent. I do not consent to this, sir. This, I'm, I am not okay with this. <laughs> me too. Me too. Uh, please stop. Now you're using my voice against my will. I plead the fifth. I don't think that works here, but we're gonna plead it anyway. <laughs> So I don't think they're gonna be happy about me being Our boss new man. So lifelike, I keep mistaking them for real people. Yeah, why do you do that? Keep them as robots. It makes things really easy. <laughs> now that I'm the director, y'all, y'all bitches, good to see. You're gonna you. listen to me. Feeling well today? No, I'm, I'm not. I'm not feeling well. You guys, are gonna listen to me. Take good care of yourself. You won't have to see too much. Take care of yourself. Don't see too much of me. I don't want to see. I don't want to see too much of you either, bud. Can we just like? <laughs> can we just agree to not like each other? <laughs> All right, well, let's let's go to One this day, meeting. I'll design a more efficient reactor to replace that old clunker in the basement. Yeah, Rosalind, we just put that old clunker in the basement together. So how about you uh, be grateful that you have power and you're not all starving? Jeez, Rosalina, she's such a meanie. She's such, she's such a she's so prissy. All right, where am I going? Up another layer? Can I? Nah. So can I go out there and fly up? I'll just go up the staircase over here, which is this way, right? Yeah. I wonder if the synths addressed me like a director yet. Oh, oh, I get to be head honcho. Dr. Carlin's doing some amazing the first to things with our genetically We're engineered products. Oh, I have to get out of my power armor. It's a sad, sad day. It's a sad, sad day. <laughs> yeah, I'm the new director. I hope you like tricorn hats, bitches. <laughs> yeah, move over. There's the new director in town. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> what kind of work? will we be doing exactly? Well, normally the directorate reviews and approves research tracks for the various divisions. Today, however, we're here for a different reason. Right now we're all here because it's finally time to stand up for ourselves. Let's not be dramatic, Justin. There's nothing dramatic about it. We're in a position to push back, to it's assert ourselves movements. here. That's what we've talked about all along. To bring you up to speed, obviously there are groups in the Commonwealth that stand in opposition to the Institute's goals. With the reactor now online, we have the ability to not only expand synth production, but to project power to a much greater degree. Where are you going with this? What's the Institute's goal? Well, 
The Directorate has agreed that steps must be taken to ensure our safety in the long run. Let's just spit it out, shall we? The Directorate has decided that the Brotherhood of Steel need to be eliminated. As the incoming mouth. Director, we felt it important to inform you of the decision and get your thoughts on it. So, where do you stand? Hmm. I guess we have to. If it has to happen, we keep the violence at minimum and all else the Commonwealth, I agree. Last thing is to needs now to make things worse if you're trying to avoid conflict. Not start. I mean, I, I kind of agree with that one. Shouldn't we wait and see? Get an announcement sometime before sneaking in? I think the last thing the Institute needs now is to make things worse. We should be trying to avoid conflict, not starting it. I would love to see that big airship fly off over the horizon, but it's not going to happen. The conflict is already upon us. Unless we end it now, it's only going to get worse. We really don't have a choice. If we're to emerge from this the victors, we need to move quickly. As director, it's up to you and how we focus our efforts in achieving this goal. We'd like your input on what direction we should take. Do we increase synth production or focus on weapons development? Give me some fancy weapons! Let's go! We don't need no more crappy human robots! Result choice being if you want informed decision, tell you what. Here. What would the results of this choice be? I'd like to make a well-informed decision. Well, if we increase synth production, we'd be able to deploy more of them to the Commonwealth to aid in our operations. Weapon development would improve the weapons we have available to us now, making our synths more effective in the field. Which would you prefer we focus on? Hmm. Hmm. I've seen enough to know that weapons are the key to winning wars. Let's Hell focus yeah, on man. weapons development. As you wish. The advanced systems folks will get to work immediately. Thank you very much for your time, sir. Hell yeah, That's guys. all we have for the moment. I believe Father wished to speak with you once our meeting concluded. Rushed work is sloppy at best, and deadly at worst. You always say that. All right, get me out of this chair. <laughs> get me out of here. Apologies. I'm back in my suit. Oh, oh, I think he wanted to say something to me. He's like, apologies, I have a message that it cut off. Apologies. I have an urgent message from D-114. Your quarters have flooded, sir. Hey! There is danger of extensive damage to your personal effects. Hey, I'm, I'm not, I'm not, not okay. Oh, uh, oh, Z-114, no that's the railroad. Okay, so that was the progress with the railroad. Has done uh, I'm sorry, progress with the him. Institute thing that the, right here, so you can do your work with the father. They wanted me to progress with the Institute, and that's probably the railroad trying to get a hold of me. So they're probably trying to cut me off right before end of the line, if I had to guess, Thank which, I would not let me mark that. Because, we're, we're, again, we're going to do the Institute first, and we'll come back. We'll do the, the rail. I think we'll have to do the railroad. I think it might be a good idea to make a save, actually, like right here, with me being in the railroad, doing like X amount, or I'm sorry, being in the institute, about to hit up the railroad stuff, so then I can switch over, quickly do the railroad quest line. I still have my old save. So this one with me outside my power armor is my before I have decided. This one is I have continued. Uh, the the institute up to a point where I'm about to beat it, and I'm also able to go do railroad things. So that's good. And then we can go back. We can do the Brotherhood, and then we can do the Minutemen. So that should make that should make it pretty easy. So let's go to Advanced Systems, and I guess check out her her new weapons. Hey, we you got more than enough power. Hey, it's that guy. Reactor. It's that guy. Enrico. I'll sleep a lot easier now that the reactor's online. You guys remember that guy? He was it's the dude the suit. Thing Dr. Lee was able to refurbish that old reactor. All right, but it is, however, time to wrap it up here, guys. I'm sorry to say episode 962 of Fallout 4. Thank you guys all for watching. Apologies. No! I have an urgent message from Z114. Oh, and I'll Your see quarters you next have flooded, time. sir. <laughs> there is danger of Doodle. extensive damage.